Imagine your every move tracked by this. Within seconds, you can attach this to a car and begin tracking your subject. It's a GPS device, small, secretive, and can be hidden underneath your car. It's an alarming trend. Our investigation found men across the country arrested for stalking or harassing after hiding GPS trackers on women's cars. Prosecutors say the ongoing case of Sean Tymon illustrates the problems. Police say Tymon used a GPS tracking device like this one and placed it on his co-worker's car. Then he used it to track her movements for days. Tymon was charged with stalking after police say these surveillance cameras caught him crawling under her car. Mr. Tymon, I'm with Inside Edition. Can I talk to you for a minute, sir? No, thank you. Tymon is pleaded She's not guilty. Our producer tried to speak with him as he entered court in Massachusetts. She said she was absolutely terrified when she found out there was a GPS tracking device on her car. Do you have anything to say? Any comment? No comment. So, Steve, are we seeing these turn up more and more with divorce cases and stalking cases? Very often. With the ease to purchase and the ease to place on a car, we're seeing it more and more. Inside Edition security consultant Steve Cardian says in efficient. many states, it is illegal to hide a GPS tracker on a car that you don't own, but not in Georgia. I couldn't believe it. I didn't think it was legal. Melissa Atkins says she was shocked when she discovered a GPS device like this one when she hit a curb and it fell off her car. I felt terrified. I felt like my privacy was completely invaded. The person tracking her movements secretly took this video of her and her daughter. Turns out it was this licensed private metal. detective. And you just get down underneath the car and then you're good. Eric Eccles showed us how he hit a GPS under Melissa's car. She claims that, you know, she was traumatized by what you did. I personally don't think she was traumatized. Eccles said he was hired by a jealous woman who believed her husband was cheating with Melissa. But Melissa says there was no affair. And you weren't even cheating. There was no cheating. Eccles was never charged with a crime, but Melissa did sue him for invasion of privacy and trespassing. Her lawyer, Chuck Bachman. The problem is this allows you to track them every second of the day, wherever they go. The case went to trial and the jury sided with Eccles. A jury decided in my favor, and I'm glad that that happened. There was no reason for him to do this except for just to harass me and scare me. Despite the verdict, Melissa says only the police armed with a search warrant should be able to track people without their knowledge. Everybody has a right to their privacy. Generally speaking, if you own the car, you can install a tracker. But since GPS laws vary by state, it's best to talk with a lawyer before you do anything.